So our next presenter this evening is Dan Mountain. Yeah, lots of friends in the audience, it sounds like. Dan has been building art in Black Rock City since the 2015 Temple of Promise and has continued to build art on and off Playa since then. And this is the first year he's the lead artist on a project. He lives on the peninsula at an uh, artist collective there where he's building the project. And this will be his seventh burn in 10 years. So please join me in welcoming Dan Mountain to the stage. Hi, everybody. Hi. Um, I rewrote the script earlier today, so this won't necessarily match up with the slides, but bear with me. Uh, IOY is a piece about communication, about how fear, anxiety, and other self-appointed challenges can disrupt people's way of communicating from saying what they really mean. Oftentimes, people think that the spoken language is the way to communicate, but many times something as simple as a look or a gesture can be equally as effective. When I was six, I had a crush on a girl who was hearing impaired at the community pool. I didn't know sign language and she couldn't hear me, so we decided to go up to the office where you get ice cream and ping pong and ask for, pa for paper and pen. We would write messages to each other until the space on the paper ran out or it was time to go home. Yeah, pretty cute, right? <laughs> Many years later, when I was in Japan visiting a friend, we went to a bar with his two friends who spoke almost no English. I spoke and continued to speak very little Japanese. However, after a while of pointing at things and saying the word loudly, as if that would help, we, by some stroke of odd luck, realized that we all spoke Spanish. And so from there, we went ghost hunting at an 800-year-old Buddhist temple, and I couldn't have planned that. And that's what this is about. This is about moments that, like these that you can't predict. Um, the will and need to say how you feel is, an inher is inherent in everyone, and sometimes you're too terrified to say it. This piece is about facing your fear and saying it and doing it. So... There's me. There's the Temple of Promise, which was my first build. Temple of Promise crew, what's up? We did it. So this is how the structure is actually going to work. It's been fabricated by uh, Jeff Schomburg and engineered by uh, RBHU or RHBU, I can never remember. <laughs> uh, it is an 18-foot uh, steel armature or steel structure that's been fabricated and certified to be placed in the public afterwards. <laughs> uh, inside, it's uh, clad in rusty car parts, rusty sheet metal, anything we can find that's interesting. And inside, it houses a cabling system armature that allows the participants to move the fingers. And so, yeah, it's going to be cool. Uh, there's been a few times in my life where being bad at math has gotten me into trouble, but this is the one time where my bad math has actually made it bigger and more impressive, so <laughs> get ready. <laughs> um, this piece is about working together to convey and receive forms of communication for a common goal, even if there isn't a tom common tongue. Everyone goes to Burning Man for their own reason, and I hope with this piece people can achieve or attain those off-chance moments that you can't predict of magic and create memories that last a lifetime and span the globe. Of the 10 principles of Burning Man, that I, the one I most resonate with is radical inclusion. With this piece, get in there. With this piece, everyone is invited to participate. There are no strangers, just friends we don't know yet. Only through collaboration with others will IOI become alive. IOI means I love you, by the way. I'm really excited for, the, for a moment that I may never experience, an individual or a group of people seeing ILY from afar, doing a double take to see if it really is moving, and then deciding to go investigate. That moment of deciding to change direction and somehow follow, and follow something that somehow speaks to you, is what this piece is all about. And it shoots fire. All right, we out here, we'll see you out there. <laughs>